We regularly delight our subscribers by featuring flying cars, new generation special vehicles, innovative devices and huge vehicles of unusual design. Now, what about developments that raise a lot of questions and shock already with their appearing? A driven couch car, a Peel three-wheel chariot from the UK, and an incredible Ferrari concept from the 70s. We compiled for you the top 7 most random cars that can surprise anyone. This is the Innovative Text Channel. Let's get started. Porsche 996 Hoverboard Bell & Bell These days, Porsche cars are associated with speed, beauty, and wealth. Well, what if you can't afford a sports car by this company but really want to become the owner of Porsche? The Bell & Bell Workshop has solved this issue in a very extravagant way. They made a sofa car from parts of the 966 model with its name being used internally to designate the Porsche 911. In fact, designers combine the front and rear of the car, placing the seat in the middle. However, the look of a compact Porsche sofa is a trifle compared to its functionality. In addition to working headlights, the presented product boasts a built-in electric drive and a movable chassis. They are controlled by two levers, each of which is responsible for one of the wheels. That undoubtedly makes a proper mobile living room. Peel P50 Imagine the smallest car in the world that looks like a hellish three-wheeled stroller. At this point, you hardly think of a car that looks like the Peel P50. This is a British-made microcar that will shock fans of luxury cars. The P50 has got 4.2 horsepowers, while its weight is below 130 pounds. It is so light as for a car that it can be lifted and manually pushed into a garage or a building. The car can only fit one person, and tall people can say goodbye to the idea of getting inside the peel. The headlight is also one here. Engineers did not deliver the reverse gear either. The current peel has gone electric and is available in three versions. The most powerful of them is the E50 Turbo, with a top speed of 37 miles per hour. The Phone Car So a sofa car and a miniature three-wheeled monster are covered which means it's time to move on to a weird vehicle called the phone car. At first glance, creating of this prototype has no justification, but the head of Daytel Communications does not agree with that. The car serves as a mobile advertising platform. It is built on the basis of a Model 75 Volkswagen Beetle. Due to peculiarities of the converted body, an adult can hardly fit in the car, and the speed of the vehicle does is below 31 miles per hour. It can definitely claim to be the weirdest car in the world. Flatmobile The height of the car is 19 inches, its length is 145 inches, and its width is below 65 inches. Here is the flattest car in the world that has received a quite expected name, Flatmobile. The creator of this punt is famous engineer Perry Watkins, who regularly shocks the public with strange projects. Interestingly, the comics about Batman, or rather the very Batmobile, push the engineer to create a unique car. Watkins took the 1963 Hillman Imp production car as the basis for the future transport. It took 18 months to turn an ordinary car into a flatmobile prototype. The apotheosis of this transformation was the installation of a real jet gas turbine engine. It has a special afterburner mode that throws the car forward consuming about 4 liters of fuel per minute. The maximum speed of the car reaches 99 miles per hour. Ferrari 512S Modulo Automotive concepts are designed to boggle our imaginations and to give people an idea of the future of mechanical engineering. This is exactly what Ferrari did in 1970, unveiling the 512S Modulo show car first shown at the Geneva Motor Show. The concept of a futuristic car was developed by Pininfarina. The mid-engine sports coupe has received a stunning body reminiscent of a spaceship. Closed wheel arches, low clearance, wedge shape and unusual glazing. The car looks so cool that even 50 years later, it can compete in design with the concepts of the 21st century. There are no familiar doors here, since their role is played by a hood consisting of a windshield, roof and side windows. It slides forward and opens access to the car. Since the concept is based on a charged Ferrari 512S, its stuffing is also impressive. 
a 550 horsepower V12 engine, and a 5-speed gearbox, in theory, can accelerate the prototype to 220 miles per hour. Big Banana Car If the world's lowest car and a blasting Ferrari concept wasn't enough for you, how about a banana car? Yes, this is a car featuring a huge movable fruit that can accommodate four passengers. This is the Big Banana Car, which was built by an enterprising Michigan inventor. It is built on the basis of the famous Ford F-150 pickup truck. The length of the car reaches 274 inches and the height is as much as 121.6 inches. There is no roof here, so a ride at a maximum speed of 85 miles per hour offers an unforgettable impression. Interestingly, in 2011, an unusual transport set a rather strange record. It was officially recognized as the longest banana car in the world. You must agree it is difficult to deny the record, since there are not so many cars on our planet in the form of a huge banana. Toyota Vios Limo Motif Today's parade of strange cars ends with a real Frankenstein from the world of vehicles. The project, called the Toyota Vios Limo Motive, received as many as eight wheels, six of which are located at the rear of the vehicle. A double-deck chassis makes this car stand out from other fans of extreme tuning. The creator of the eight-wheel version of the Vios is an ordinary owner of one of the taxi fleets in Indonesia. By his own admission, he built this monster for fun. Tractive effort is transmitted to only one rear axle, which spins the other two. In the end, it seems as if the car has tremendous power, but in fact, it does not. Despite the significant tuning of the rear, such transformation does not provide for any real benefit, although it looks very brutal and strong. Despite the fact that the automotive industry is moving towards unification, talented and at times a bit crazy inventors keep surprising us with strange developments. Which of the presented projects impressed you most and why? Share your answers in the comments below. This was Innovative Techs. We don't bid farewells, we say, see you again.